Hi everyone! When shopping around, have you ever been offered to add items to your cart that are related to the product you're about to buy? Well, with Yeet WooCommerce frequently bought together, you can add a section to your product pages to suggest products that are usually bought together. Before we get into it, let me remind you we list the links to the documentation, the plugin, and the live demo in the description below, so you can go ahead and check it out and test the plugin. And now, let's get to it! You have probably seen several times sections on e-commerce websites that display products that are similar or related to the product you're looking at. For example, you're looking at the newest PlayStation and you see a joystick and a game as suggested products. This is the case even on well-known platforms like Amazon. And this is the scenario you can achieve on your own e-commerce store with our Yeet Frequently Bought Together plugin. Now let's see this example. It's a camera, and below all this, we have this section where we have the same product here, the camera, and the products it is usually bought with. We have a protective case and the sheets to print the photos. These are two very necessary items that the customer needs to get if he buys this camera. Now let me show you how this is added to the product page. Let's go to Edit Product. Now we're on the product edit page, we're going to scroll down to the product data section here, frequently bought together. The first option we have is the products type. We can select the type of products we're going to use in that frequently bought together section. We can use products that are related by tags or categories. We can use cross-sell products, upsell products, these are the ones you add here in the linked product section or you can select custom products, which is what we have in this case. This is the option that lets you enter any products you want to include in this products frequently bought together section. You can see we have the sheets and the protective case here. In the following option, you can decide if you want to show all selected products or a limited number of products. If we select this one, we can choose the number of products that are going to be shown randomly. Then we can just show the products unchecked. If you remember, the products were checked on the product page. Then you can add an additional text to show before the products. You can apply a discount on the linked products. In this case, I added a percentage discount of 10%. And you can also apply conditions for this discount. It can be an amount spent condition or a minimum number of items selected. I didn't set any conditions for the amount spent, but I did set conditions here. So the discount is going to be applied only if the user selects three products. So that's the camera, the protective case, and the sheets. Now let's go check out the plugin settings. Let's go to Yid, frequently bought together. Okay, before moving on, let me remind you to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that bell down below so you get notifications every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's continue with the video. Here we have three tabs. We have Settings, Label and Style, and Linked Products. In the Settings tab, we're going to find the plugin's general options, like the box title. In this case, it's just frequently bought together, but you can add any title here. The image size. And there's even an option to redirect users to the checkout page after they add the products to the cart. Then we have what the discount name is, if we want to highlight the discount or not. The box position, you can position it below the product summary, above the product tabs, below them. Use this shortcode to just add the frequently bought together box to the product page or above product meta. And you also have the option to upload the loader image here. Now let's move on to the second tab, label and style. Here we can configure the labels shown on the front end and the colors. First, we have the labels. For example, you can change the price label for single products, for double products, for multiple products. You can also change the label for the add to cart button for single products, two products or more. You can also change the label for the button that lets you select the variation. In this case, it's view options. And then here we have the colors. We can choose the background color and button colors. And lastly, we have the linked products tab. Here we can find the list of all the products included in the frequently bought together box. 
Under product, we have the products that have a frequently bought together box on their individual product pages. And under linked products, we see the products that are added to those frequently bought together boxes. We also have the option to delete here. So we can delete each one of these groups, this one for example, or just use bulk actions to delete several groups. And there's also a search field to search for specific groups. Now let me show you something. In case you're creating a page, for example, let's go to pages, add new. We're going to use this as a test page. You can add a frequently bought together box here on any page of your site by just using a shortcode or a widget. Let me show you. First, let's click here, add block, shortcode, and here you could enter the shortcode of the frequently bought together block you want to show. You just have to add this shortcode and the product ID. Or I can remove this shortcode and I can add this frequently bought together form that just adds the shortcode for us. And here you just enter the product ID. Also, keep in mind that this plugin is integrated with plugins like Yid Added to Cart Pop-Up and Yid Wishlist so you can get the most out of these plugins. Don't forget to give this plugin a try by going into the live demo, you'll find it in the description below. Okay, so that's how the plugin works. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and we'll meet again for our next video. Bye.